Well, this is the last weekend that most kids in Albuquerque have off before they head back to school next week. And many of you may want to know where you can take the kids to have some sledding fun in the snow this weekend. All right, but as you know, there's a problem with this. We haven't gotten a lot of snow, so is it safe to sled? We sent News 13's David Romero to the East Mountains to go find out. It's still a winter wonderland heading up to the Sandias, but it's not wide enough for some people to enjoy playing in designated areas. We have a set of specific criteria that we run through, and we have to meet all those criteria before we decide to open the area or not. Now, this may be as close as you can get to the Kapolein Snowplay area, but forest rangers say there's still a lot more fun to be had up here. People are welcome to sled anywhere on the National Forest lands here in the Sandias at their own risk. But outside of those areas that are where sledding is specifically prohibited. And that's just what we found a little ways down the road. Chris Dyke and his family taking advantage of the snow in a safe area. I think that uh, if you take the proper precautions uh, with the children and make sure the area is safe, um, that, uh, that that's fine. I mean, it's always sledding at your own risk. But uh, I, think, I think if you're careful that, it, that it's fine. But it's when people are not careful that you find this. A viewer sent us these pictures from over the New Year's holiday of people parked alongside bad spots on the windy road up to the crest. Rangers remind everyone not to block the road on those dangerous corners. In addition, there are at least three other specific spots you can't sled on at any time. Those include the 10K trailhead, the pit near mile marker 5 on Highway 36, and the Tree Springs trailhead. Otherwise, go out and, and have, enjoy the snow, whether you're cross-country skiing or snowshoeing or sledding or just hiking on some of, the, some of the trails. We would encourage people to do that. These kids look like they're having an awful lot of fun there. And the Ranger Parsons tells us he also wants folks to, they, they are, that the Rangers are going to try to have uh, Capulene snow area open to coincide with Christmas vacation for the kids. And it hasn't happened yet. The break is almost over. He says check their website every single day. They'll let you know as soon as they get enough. You can find a link to that attached to this story at krqe.com. Elizabeth.